Hello friends, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to this new video. In this practical, we are going to learn the different types of fungi that are there in the syllabus. The first fungus that is there in the syllabus is called rhizomes. It is also called bread mold. Bread mold. The rhizomes is a fungus which grows on organic matter like bread and other food matter. Mycelium is, is hidden within the substratum at the time of reproduction. Long elongated sporangiophores will arise. At the tip of each sporangiophore, there is a sporangium. The sporangium will produce spores. I will give the life cycle of uh, rhizopus later. Peziza. Peziza is a cup fungus. In case of Peziza, the reproductive structures are called Aporthesia. They are cup shaped structures, a saucer shaped structures. And each cup shaped structure, there are acai. The acai will produce ascospores. So this is Peziza. Next fungus is Paxinia. Paxinia graminis. Paxinia graminis. Paxinia, the life cycle of Paxinia is very complicated. It is, uh, it actually survives on two different hosts. One is called the Burberry, the other one is called the Wheat. Okay, so the primary host is the Wheat. And this is the Burberry plant, Burberry plant, and uh, this is the leaf of the Burberry plant. So on Burberry plant, the Paxinia grows. Burberry is the secondary host and uh, wheat is the primary host. Wheat is the primary host. Okay. So Paxinia gramulus survives on two different hosts. Primary host is wheat, secondary host is Burberry. The third fungus that we are studying is Sarcospora. Sarcospora is causing a disease called Tikka disease. These are the infected groundnut leaves. Infected groundnut leaves. And this is the herbarium of a groundnut leaf that is infected by Sarcospora. There are two species of Sarcospora. Sarcospora arachidicola and Sarcospora personica. Agaricus. Agaricus is also called mushroom. So this is agaricus. These are the basidiocarps or fruiting bodies. Agaricus and uh, the fruiting bodies of agaricus are called basidiocarp. And in this basidiocarp, the top one is the pileus. There is a, uh, there is a stalk. The stalk is called stipe. So this is the agaricus. Organism that we are studying is lichen. We have a different type of lichens. These are lichens. Okay. There are different types of lichens. For example, this is the folios lichen. This is the folios lichen. And uh, this is the fruticose lichen. Frutex means shrub, fruticose lichen. And uh, we have crustose lichen. This is crustose lichen, where the lichen is growing on the rocks or stones. Crustose lichen. This is the folios lichen, folios lichen. And uh, this is the fruticose lichen. Fruticose lichen. So this is the lichens. Okay. So in the practical examination, these materials, in addition to these, even the materials belonging to pathology and bryophyte also will be kept. You have to identify them. 
and you have to write the classification, draw the diagram and write four or five important points. I thank the first BSc CBZ class for participating in the preparation of this video. I especially thank Varun for taking the videos and I also thank Niveshika Madam for being a part of this practical. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe. We'll meet again in the next video with some other topic. Thank you very much.